Around 300,000 Jews lived in Spain before the Catholic monarchs Isabella and Ferdinand, fresh from reconquering Spain from the Moors, demanded Jews and Muslims convert to the Catholic faith or else leave the country. Now in an attempt to right the wrongs of the past, the Spanish government will allow the descendants of Spanish Jews expelled in 1492 to seek Spanish nationality without giving up their current citizenship. Today marks the end of the parliamentary process that, when it comes into force on October 1st, 2015, will open the door again to the descendants of those who were unfairly expelled from Spain. The term used in Hebrew to refer to Jews of Spanish descent is Faradi, or Sephardic, from the Hebrew word for Spain. The old Jewish quarters in medieval Spanish cities, such as Toledo or Cordoba, where Jews lived among Christians and Muslims before the Reconquista, or Catholic victory over the Moors, were known to have made numerous contributions to science, music, and literature. This is a historical, important, and emotional day for the Sephardic world in general. A new era between the Jewish and the Hispanic world opens. Perhaps it was a bit delayed, perhaps 500 years late, but Spain came forth, a date with history. The law potentially allows an estimated 3.5 million residents of countries where many Sephardic Jews eventually settled, such as the U.S., Israel, France, Turkey, Mexico, Argentina, and Chile, to apply for Spanish nationality. Prospective applicants must prove their Sephardic background through their surnames, language, or ancestry, and get a certificate from the Federation of Jewish Communities in Spain.